Your boy's officially home, man. Ah, uh, Florida was, it was a lot of fun, but I'm kind of happy to be back home. About to start up the S2K real quick, just to get everything going. Car's been sitting for a little while, and I like to have everything running properly, so just gonna start up the S2K. Uh, get all the fluids running and all, that, and all that good stuff. All right, so I'm gonna start the car up real quick. It's been a good minute before this car has been started. And uh, yeah, y'all like my uh, jet tag? What is that, launch key? Nice, right? It's pretty dope. All right, so let's start it up. Give the car a couple revs. What is good everybody, welcome back to the channel. As you guys can see, it snowed. And it was a whole big dilemma on Thursday. It took me about six hours to get home. But today's video is gonna be more geared towards the S2K. I know you guys missed those videos, I've noticed. But um, yeah, so right now I'm taking my tarp, well my uh, car cover off the S2K. All the snow is falling off. But the car stayed clean the whole entire time. Um, so today we're gonna be running into a junkyard because I seen two S2Ks sitting in a junkyard with some dope parts on them. So I want to go and check it out and see if those parts are still there. But tomorrow, which is Sunday, because today is Saturday, um, I will be at be at Import Expo in Atlantic City. I made the I put a, a a flyer up in the community tab for some of you guys to see if you wanted to meet me or not. Um, the car will not be in the car show because that car show is just way too long and it's so far of a drive. But I'm probably going to drive the S2K and just leave it in the, the spectator's lot. But um, I'm going to finish taking off the, the tarp, clearing off the car because I'm probably going to have to wash it later so that way I could go to Atlantic City tomorrow. So, just found the the, the, the address because I actually seen this these S2Ks on uh, Craigslist. Like I've been seeing it on there for like the past couple weeks, and um, I was like, yo, I gotta go check it out because they got a couple parts that I might want. There's a yellow one there with like interior mods in there and like bride seats and like stuff like that. So if they're not like too expensive, I might come home with something today. Like if the junkyard is trying to charge me like crazy prices, then obviously I'm not buying it because then I'll just buy it new. But like if they got something there that's worth buying and it's cheap, I'm gonna take it. Even like little small interior parts that my S2K don't have, I'm probably just gonna take those. Like I wanna have that cover for the uh, for when uh, the soft top is up, so that way you can't look into the back of the car. I want to get that, and I want to get a couple other like little small pieces that I don't have. Maybe some tail lights, just in case I do get rid of my uh, my buddy club tails. Like I might try to get some like AP2 tails or something like that. So we'll see. Two lanes to merge onto I-78 East. Alright, so we just made it out to the junkyard. I brought a couple of my tools with me just in case I needed to use them. But um, I'm about to go in and see if they actually still have the two SUKs here. Hopefully they do. I didn't drive all the way over here for no reason. Well, it wasn't that far. It's like 10 minutes. But it's right over there. So, let's go see if we can get some new S2K parts for the low low. Oh, I see the S2K right there. All right, so I just came to the junkyard and they didn't have the taillights I was looking for, but I did find this Suzuka blue one. 
and it's pretty neat. What do you guys think? Any parts out of here you guys would possibly want? Let me know. Ugh. They got like the rear clip of a silver S2K too. They got this silver one here too. But there's really no like parts that I need to be honest with you. Yeah. They got a dash with the dash. The airbag deployed. But this was the one that I was looking for. But yo, this S2K has a cage in it, y'all. Bride seats and everything. I'm about to find out how much they about to let it go for. Oh my god, I see mad parts in this car that I want. About to find out how much they gonna let that cage go for. Oh, I hope they let it go for a steal. They even got an AP1 headlight, but it looks like the other side is broken. But that yellow one is goals right now. Let's see what we could do. Any CRV parts back here? So many S2Ks. There's three S2Ks. It's an S2K clip right there too. The rear end. So your boy just picked up a cage for a fucking steal. I didn't even know it was gonna be in there, bro. Oh man. Oh man, yo. Wait until I get in the car. I gotta get in the car so we can talk. We gotta talk. Oh shit. This is what happens when you 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 get paid and you spend money and you don't realize. I'm excited though, I'm excited. So, my whole purpose of coming to this junkyard was to get the uh, buddy club tails that they had in here on that yellow S2K. That yellow S2K has mad parts, bro. Like, mad parts. Like, I'm low-key, like they were selling um, two bride seats in there with brackets for like a dumb good price. I'm low-key, like the bride seats are pretty like fucked, but like, I mean, Mark does interior, so it's like really nothing. But I'm like really debating on really copping them shits and just like either reselling them or like um, either reselling them or uh, like putting them in my car. So I don't know. I don't know, man. Like I feel like I probably could resell them and get a good price for them. Like my cage, I got it for a steal, bro. I got the Mad Dog cage. So you know that that one is like a nice one. Like it's not, I think Mad Dog might be better than Cusco. I'm not like 100% sure, but I think it's better than Cusco. And like, I'm really like sitting here like, yo, I really just found the cage. I literally came here for the taillights and I left out getting a cage. I'm excited about this. I've been dying to get a cage. It's black, but I might get it powder, well, I'm gonna get it powder coated. I'm gonna get it powder coated and then just like, do all the extra extra that I want to do, make it look cool inside the car. But um, I'm I'm like super excited. Like, <sighs> junkyard finds, baby, junkyard finds. A lot of people sleep on Craigslist, and I'm telling you, Craigslist be having like the, the stuff for y'all, bro. I'm kind of sick that I wasn't able to get it today though, because like I really wanted to get it today, but I'll just have to come back on Monday and pick it up. Um, I already paid for it in, in, in cash and everything like that. Paid for it, so all I gotta do is come pick it up. So they're gonna have everything taken out, use all the hardware, and that car's an AP-1 too, so everything's gonna line up perfectly. Turn left onto Raymond Boulevard. But um, right now, um, I'm about to uh, go get some food because I'm like starving like crazy. I'm hungry. Alright, so I just came to Dick's Sporting Goods because I need to get another inner tube for the hard top to seal it off. Uh, when I took off my hard top the last time, I was missing a couple pieces and I couldn't find it. So right now I'm here trying to figure out which inner tube I can use so that way my uh my my uh soft top I mean not my soft top my hard top is like firmly fitted on the car so i'm about to just look at this just to make sure it's the like nice width because i had got um i had bought two one was kind of a, more of a like a wider width and the other one was a lot slimmer so i want to make sure that this one has a nice width on it too so that way it fills the whole entire bottom of the the hard top Okay, so I went with the 27.5 standard 
bike inner tube if you want to use it for your own s2000 on um, a hardtop it just helps with like the squeaking wind noise and stuff like that just gives it a better seal at the bottom of it so i'm gonna go with this one it's definitely gonna work out good because this is what i have on the back end of the the s2k i just need to use it for the sides so 27.5 for those of you who don't know